today I will be demonstrating a progress bar okay I've already prepared some code to use so this is how it works now firstly uh, this is what my GUI looks like okay and I'm just using spring controls to execute the program now the one progress bar we have is an infinite progress bar it doesn't show percentage or something it just shows that it's loading okay and then the second one is a percentage progress bar it shows um, the percentage of completion now um, the methods I'm using is swing worker now the way it works is it's like a thread it works exactly the same principle now in the button I'm going to use start with the infinite one first I'm create it, I'm going to call it a task progress infinite task infinite okay now if I execute that it automatically goes to this method here progress infinite swing worker now this is the progress bar of the infinite one and um, inter indeterminate it means that it doesn't have a percentage to it now it looks like this basically Okay, phase one. Okay, see, it's just loading, loading, loading until the object is completed. Okay, now what I've done is it does some background calculations while while the progress bar is running. Now the way that works, it's by thread and it's called a swing worker. Now first you declare in your class, in your main class, a private progress infinite. Okay, then you create a class of progress infinite and you extend swing worker void void you add an override um, annotation and you say public void do in background and you put your methods there and you always have to add the return null after that you say you also add your method done it automatically overrides the method they, that Java has given and then it's just to complete the task so I'm going to show it again. This method does the the progress bars, um, yeah, whatever, and that calls the method calculations. Now that's the background calculations that the program is going to do, which is these mathematics. It's also just a bit of stuff like absolute values and um, round up and round down. It's minimum, maximum, pi, sin, cos, and tan log and powers and then also square roots and random numbers now that all does in the background while while the progress bar showing the amount of completion okay I'm going to show it again phase one okay yeah we've got a little bit of an output just as it finished that finished there then it stopped now for the other one it shows percentage now what I've done is I've taken the mathematical calculations I've divided it into the progress bar of this percentage one like here we've got a um, value of naught okay, let me just show you how it works like ah oh, not build man let's just see if we can stop this okay okay I wanna test it okay phase two now this shows the percentage of completion as you can see I divided it in a few tasks um, I've added a sleep method otherwise it uh, completes too quickly and you won't see the effect of it so this is it um, at naught value then it does a sleep for 1.5 seconds and it does this and then the J progress bar sets it to 20 and then does this and then so on and so forth I can actually take these out and then it'll just go quickly and very fast and just see okay here's another one should be one at the bottom yep 
Okay, now let's see how fast it does. I use the done method uh, at a hundred percent task complete, and then I set it to do to go to value naught again. Just looks better that way. Okay, let's test it. Phase two. See, it's already quick. So that's why I've added the sleep method. It's a sleep. It's a method just a thread dot sleep, and then the amount of milliseconds that, and you always have to put in a try catch. Now. Basically, again, quick um, crash course. Again, what you need to do is in your button, you want to execute that method, which is this. I'm just going to use the shorter one. Okay, so this is uh, basically another thread uh, with two methods. Now you can create it there, define actually. First, you define, call it, execute. Now, within that, you can execute another method, which works in the same way as a thread. And that's basically it. There's a J progress bar that actually works. Um, I've been searching for one, I couldn't find one. There we have one. Thanks for watching the video.